Hi everyone, welcome back to the channel. Still using the iPhone X and wondering how to make it feel brand new in 2025? What if I told you that you can try the look and feel of iOS 26 right now, without buying a new device, and update it with jailbreak tweaks? As you know, even if you check for software updates and settings, you'll see beta updates for the iOS 26 developer beta, or public beta. If you select those options you won't get the update either, as Apple restricts this firmware to the iPhone X series. In this video, I'll walk you through how to update your iPhone X to the latest iOS 26 experience, and the best part? You can keep all your favorite jailbreak tweaks fully working. Whether you're a power user or just love tweaking your phone's design, this is the perfect guide for you. Let's dive into it. First, if you want to get features iOS 26 on your old iPhone, you must jailbreak your device. You can jailbreak your device with computer or without computer. To jailbreak your device, you can watch this video. I have uploaded this video, so you can jailbreak your iDevice to get iOS 26 jailbreak tweaks. Once you've successfully jailbroken your iPhone, you'll find the Palerain Loader app on your home screen. Open it and tap Install. Then open Celio app to get and install iOS 26 jailbreak tweaks features on your iPhone. First, to get the liquid glass feature in iOS 26, you can download Seek 26. You can get this tweak from the Core UX repo. You can find the download link in the description. After that, add the repo or URL to Celio and click Add Resource. Then search for CC26 to get the Liquid Glass Control Center in iOS 26. Click Get and Install. If you see the error message while installing SEC26, you have to install Elekit first. Search LA Kit, then click Install. This will install CC26 and Elekit simultaneously. However, some devices may already have Elekit installed, so if you see an error like this, make sure Elekit is also installed to run Seek26. Once installed, reboot your device and see the results. The liquid glass in your control center will change, and you'll now have the iOS 26 liquid glass control center feature installed on your old iPhone. The next feature, we will install liquid glass home screen, such as the icon and dock, on iOS 26. To get the iOS 26 theme, including the dock and icons, you can install Snowboard. Use the latest version of Snowboard. I will insert the link in the description. Then search for Snowboard and install it. To install Snowboard, you'll need to respring your device. Open the Palerain app, click Actions, and then Respring. Snowboard will then be installed on your device. Once Snowboard is installed, go to Settings and select Snowboard. Here, you can add any theme and icon, including the iOS 26 theme. Next, let's download and install the iOS 26 theme using Snowboard. For the iOS 26 theme, I'll be using the Solid Glass theme. You can find the download link in the description. Download the file. Then select Open with Celio. The solid glass tweak will automatically be available for download in Celio. Click Get and Install. After successfully installing, open Snowboard settings to enable the solid glass tweak you downloaded earlier. Open Snowboard, click Select Theme, and enable it. Then, click Apply Changes. Your iPhone will automatically respring. If the respring doesn't work, you can respring it through Celio to apply the solid glass theme tweaks. As you can see, the liquid glass icon and dock have successfully installed on my iPhone X. You can also see that the liquid glass control center has been successfully installed. Here, I'll try changing the wallpaper on my iPhone to the default wallpaper from iOS 26. Here you will see the changes. As you can see here, I've successfully transformed my iPhone X to look and feel like it's running iOS 26. The control center has been upgraded with a beautiful liquid glass effect, giving it that modern and translucent look. 
I've also applied new icon styles and a custom dock layout that I originally used on my older jailbroken setup. All of these visual changes were made possible using jailbreak tweaks, which are fully working thanks. Everything runs smoothly from animations to functionality, and it truly gives my older iPhone a fresh, next-gen experience without needing to buy a new device. This proves that with the right tools and tweaks, even older iPhones can enjoy the latest iOS design language. For all the tweaks shown in this video, I'll keep updating them regularly. So if new tweaks are released or currently in development, I'll make sure to update the download links in the video description and also pin them in the comments section. Make sure to check back often for the latest updates. And that's it. Thanks for watching this video and see you on the next one.